Good morning, Citrus Hill. I have the girls basketball team here with the Pledge of Allegiance. Kennedy and Kim for the pledge. Please stand for the pledge. Place your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Morning, Citrus Hill. Happy Tuesday. These are the last announcements of this calendar year. So we are heading into finals tomorrow. It's periods one and two, schools from 7.30 to 12.06. Um, I hope you guys have been studying hard so you finish strong. Um, we, had, we had a great game on Saturday. We were able to beat Calabasas, and we have another CIF state football championship on Saturday at 6 here at Citrus Hill. Right before the game, our boys varsity basketball will be playing. And um, we are looking into doing two-for-one tickets, so stay tuned for more information regarding that. Um, today, we do have girls varsity basketball here at home, so I hope you guys could come out and support our girls varsity basketball. And then we have um, our band concert today at 6 in the theater. And on Thursday, we will have choir concert at 7 in the theater also. Um, we are wrapping up the semester. So um, it's been a great, great semester. We've had, we've had a lot of things happen, especially um, with the sad news that we received re regarding our student yesterday. But the thing that always, always surprises me and <laughs> the Sorry, the thing that always surprises me and always makes me be the proud principal of Citrus Hill is the way that this community always comes together and they just care for each other. The support that I saw from students and teachers yesterday and staff here um, and the outcry of support for our student and our students' family is something that definitely... Um, makes me feel really proud of us and how at the end of the day whatever happens we always come together as one big citrus hill family so i'm definitely very proud of that um i have with me mr elder with a couple of announcements okay good morning citrus hill hope you're having a great uh final full day uh for the semester uh, we do have two block scheduling wednesday thursday and friday so please make sure you're studying for your finals a um, couple of announcements, <clears throat> excuse me, over those three days. Please make sure whenever you are out of class, you need to have a pass. Doesn't matter where you come from, you need to have a valid pass when you are out of class. And no, you can't share a pass with somebody else that came from another classroom. You need to have your own valid pass. So for the next three days, please do not ask to go to any other teacher's classrooms because everybody will be giving finals. So you trying to go to another classroom will disrupt somebody else's finals. So please be proactive. Go see your teachers during lunch or after school today uh, to figure out when work is due. Some teachers have different deadlines of makeup work. Um, also, if you need to study for finals, uh, please uh, make sure that's being uh, taken care of. Uh, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Also, we will not be having food dropped off to attendance. So I'm overseeing attendance. Attendance will not call you out of class to have food that was dropped off for you. So please make sure you are focused on your finals and your grade um, for the semester. I've been meeting with multiple students over the past couple weeks talking about that. Now, after the Christmas break, I know we're not going to have very, uh, announcements after this. When you come back from January, there will be a few uh, announcements regarding Tardy incentives, the uh, attendance challenge between the grade levels. Seniors, you have caught the freshmen um, with their percentage. So I believe seniors, juniors are really close to, will surpass the freshman uh, percentage rate for that big party in March in the gym for your grade level. Also, first period tardies. Need to get to school. School starts at 730. Uh, so there will be some changes for first period. So please be ready for that in January to make sure you are where you're supposed to be when school starts. Okay, I hope you have a great week of finals and over to Ms. Gonzalez for more announcements. Um, so as we said, th these are the last announcements for this year. So remember Citrus Hill, um, always be the best you and make sure you find your passion and 
Have a great, great holiday and a great new year. Good morning, Citrus Hill. I'm Kion here with Hi, Ro. With the Did You Know? Kion, did you know that the electric chair was invented by a dentist? Actually, I didn't know because I read it before you. Hi, Ro. <laughs> you know, female lion completes ninety percent of hunting in the herd. Yeah. Thank you. People say that I'm the life. Citrus Hill, I'm Hi, here with the quote of the day. Strength does not come from winning. Your struggles develop your strength when you go through hardships and decide not to surrender. That is strength. Mahatma Gandhi. Thank you. They throw a soiree to make phrases meet and words. Good morning, Sitruski. We are the Taurus Teens. What happened today, Mr. Marvel? Today, Eastern December 15, 1799, George Washington dies on his Mount Vernon State. What has happened today, Mr. Marisol? On December 15, on 1819, Alabama is admitted as the 22nd state, making 11 slave states and 11 free states. Thank, Thank you. Feasts of meats and various trees. And always wants more. Good morning, Sister Cell. I'm Jairo, and National Honor Society applications are now available online for any student who meets these requirements. Be a sophomore, junior, or senior, have a current 3.5 GPA or higher, have completed uh, 20 or more hours community service, have completed or be currently enrolled in at least two AP or honor courses. Applications are available now. They must be submitted digitally by December 18th at 9 p.m. See Ms. Armstrong in room 702 for more information. Thank you. Thank you. Why is yet? And he's a yeti. He's a lot like but. Good morning, yeti. sister. So I'm Hiro and there will be a tour drive. All toys will be donated to the Mead Valley Community Center. A holiday party will be awarded to the club or class that donates the most toys. December 7th through December 17th, boxes are located in the library. See Ms. Milliman for more information. Thank you. So knows the reason, yep, that's the truth. That's the cast, and there are plenty more connected. Good morning, Sister Hill. I'm Hiro and holiday pictures by the Citrus Hill Photo Club, Monday, December 14th in the theater, Tuesday, December 15th in room 303, during lunch and after school. Cash only. Thank you. Stay classy. A word, a phrase, and a clause for everybody. My name's Therese, Mondays through Thursdays. And I'm Moises, I'm the president of the gaming club, and we have it in 301 every lunchtime. Hope to see you there. See ya. Good morning, this is Eric here with General Track Meeting. Tuesday, December 15, if so, please stop by Parent Center and see Ms. Mundy for anyone wanting to join the track team. Thank you. Hey, good morning, Citrus Hill. This is Coach Gans right here to uh, introduce you to um, tennis. Uh, we will be having tennis tryouts for boys. Um, the tryouts will be on January 20th. That is a Thursday, uh, second semester. And uh, the tryouts will begin at 3.15 p.m. and uh, go till about uh, 5 o'clock. And then um, those will be at the tennis courts. And probably the most important feature that you're going to need for the tryouts, obviously you probably need to bring your racket, but uh, the physical. You have to have a physical in order to try out. So uh, hopefully we'll see you out there on January 20th uh, for tennis. You guys have a great day. Have a good one. Meat and words and clauses. This is the elite. When the fanboys host the party, you'll see these conjunctions the most. So